Squire Maxon. Hell, huge stranger. I am Squire Maxon, royal servant of steel. It is an honor to make your acquaintance. Hey. You seem nervous, dear. Do I make you nervous? The honor is all mine, Squire. I mean, I have to respect him, to be honest. Because uh, of all the uh, legacy that uh, the whole uh, gene genealogy is tree gave, I suppose. Oh, well, thank you. Your words are very kind. Kinder than those I usually hear. Is there something I can help you with? Um, aren't you a little yawn for all this? Oh, well, you see. Yeah. I am descended from the great Roger Maxon, founder of our order. I am the last of his line. They say my soul was forged yeah. from eternal steel, but I don't believe that. I'm really just a normal boy. I was sent to the Citadel many years ago to be fostered by elder lions. But that was before the Western elders lost um, faith in the elder. I really don't know if I'll ever get home, but, well, I kind of like it here. Sentinel Lyons has been very kind to me. She's taught me so much. Hey, uh, what do you make of the Enclave, Squire? You're asking me what I think about the Enclave? Well, the Brotherhood of Steel has actually faced the Enclave before. Back west. More than 30 years ago, yep. according to our chronicles. They did. Judging from those records, I say their soldiers are outfitted in advanced power armor mark too. It's pretty and they strong. Are. <laughs> Better than our power armor. And some of their technology is amazing. Vertibirds. Vertibirds. Plasma uh -huh. weapons that can turn a man to goo. Does that help? Alright. Um, I don't suppose you know anything about the super mutants, right? Oh, yes. I've studied them quite a bit since I've been here. They're not all the same, you know. Besides the regular ones. There are also brutes. And after them, the masters. They're really tough. But the worst of all, the behemoth. He's a giant. Mm -hmm. I saw one once outside the Citadel walls. So scary. The super mutants are all over the city ruins. But Elder Lions doesn't actually think they're from there. Or we would have found their home by now. It kind of seems like they're looking for something. But we're not really sure what that is. Okay. So, um, he, sa he said it all. The super... Within the super mutants hierarchy, there are these basic ones, I mean, normal ones. Then there's the brutes, there's the masters, and the one that I thought of uh, for the Galaxy New Radio building was a behemoth. And the only one to fight it, um, I did not say I killed it on my own, but you know, was the last one. I, I mean, I kill him in the end, I suppose. Hmm. I just hope that there aren't more, uh, uh, ranks within mutants. Uh, they don't actually buy it, do they? No. But I could. I know I'm ready. I mean, it would be scary, but it's not fair that I have to sit inside while the knights go on patrol. I did go out one time, you know. Sarah, uh, Sentinel Lions took me out, just to show me. I killed a super mutant too, I swear. I, uh, I also sort of shot Sarah, but just a little. It was just a flesh wound. Oh yes, of course. Of course, it was, um, you know, a flesh wound. May we speak again soon? Yeah. What did you pick up? So There's something the on the floor. Captain Colvin. Alright, alright. Let me sit on this chair right quick. Look at the Citadel Information Terminal. Um. Well. Got some interesting things to uncover here. The, uh. uh the Enclave Tactical Assessment. Weapons. Plasma based capable of molecular. Molecular stabilization. Stabilization here. Yeah. Armor. Advanced power armor marked. Edition Verity Birds. So, uh. Yeah. Sports that I saw. 
when I turn the valve don the valve on. Pipes. Uh, tactical assessment. The enclave forces that have occupied occupied project purity are nearly identical to those encountered on the west coast in the year twenty two forty one. That potential here. In our battle after action, it is the opinion of Sentinel Alliance that the recent supermutant attack on GR was not indicative of a larger assault as was originally thought. Uh, instead, the forces that attacked the radio station were probably en route, en route to the mall to reinforce their own kind in a long battle against the mercenaries of Talon Company. <sighs> Talon Company mercs. Guys, though. Uh, General Robot. A diagnostics updated. Tribe Rothschild. Rothschild. File. Rothschild. I don't know. Rothschild. Anyways. Uh, has completed a new full diagnostic of the robot. Here are those results. Ability. 0%. Navigation translation. 0%. International. In inter internal processes. 87%. Open systems. 0%. Power measurement. Voice module. 100%. It is the assessment of Scribe and Rothschild that once the power management issues are solved, ability and navigation will jump to at least 50%. Well, within acceptable operating capacity, of course. In our soldier rotation, due to the increased activity in the vicinity of GNR, that outpost, all knights and paladins can expect to be added to the patrol rotation in that area. The squad leaders for notice Redden General Champ. Due to certain unspectacular developments, general services for initiate Redden have been cancelled. Memorial service will be scheduled sometime in the future. Eight. It um dealt with. I don't know. All right. You're right. I'm gonna need to drop the map. What is this? Hey, uh, Kelvin, right? Can I, offer you, outsiders? Uh, I have to do now, I suppose. <laughs> the Brotherhood is at your service. Lot of reinforcements on the and over two brother. Thanks. Hey, um, I'll take that. It's, it's funny to see that, um, I'm going through rash <laughs> in order to find some ambitions. Um, Hail. In this power fist. What's this? Power fist. Is it good or I don't know. I don't know if a standard round can even penetrate that stuff. Knife? Power. Power armor. Okay. See that the weight? This is 45. I don't know how I'm going to be able to repair this, but. Now you know. Hey, that's what I'm here for. Anyway, we should get back to our duties. Brotherhood of Steel Knight. Hey, did you pick up something you. Uh, earlier? Now, May we speak again soon? It seemed like this, though. Maybe I'm uh, cautious, cautious about um, what you do. Stop pushing me. <laughs> Ooh. Well, this is not a good assault rifle. Um, hunting rifle. Did the same things. The Bell information terminal. Did the same. Yeah. Like it. 
crafting for this one, I suppose. Okay. Del oh, so the Delt personnel terminal. I'm going to check. Nice. So this is also Citadel. Oh, this one is Citadel personnel. This is golden, right? Okay. So that's a. Uh, all right. Let's see. Uh, GNR soldier rotation. Due to the increased super mutant activity. Uh, okay. So this I know about. Important. Why max alien access by order of elder lions. Fire medicine not even unsupervised access to the Bailey while live fire practice is in effect. Lion's Pride recruiting. Due to the tragic death of Initiate Redden, Lion's Pride now has one opening effective immediately. Can't shoot an utterly from 150 yards blindfolded. Don't waste my time. Notice. Red in funeral chancel. So this was the same thing, right? Okay. Interesting. Um, let's have a look. Oh, so this is the robo. I do. I came back. I came back here, right? So now I have to focus my attention on the D thing. Hello, Sobo. The initiate triage protocol. Medical procedures initiated. Administering treat. Error, error. Damage you? Why did you damage me? You're supposed to be a healing robot. There has been an error in the medical subsystem. Please run a level two diagnostic. Okay. Command accepted. Beginning level two systems diagnostic. Please stand by. Wait. Diagnostic complete. Results indicate a level 7 degradation in neural pathway 0x63A82. No further information available. What is that pathway responsible for? Close a neural pathway and reroute remaining functions. Neural pathway 0x63A82 rerouted through neural pathway 0x374E82. Stand by. Full motor functions restored. Diagnostic reveals no critical failures. Asshole. Was that you hurt me? You're the worst medical robot ever. There has been an error in the medical subsystem. Please run a level two diagnostic. Initiate triage protocol. Medical procedures initiated. Administering treatment. Please stand still. Medical procedure complete. Further instructions. Yes. Acknowledged. I have to do now. Unit deactivating. This troop is hitting the rack. <laughs> All right. Me. Me just. Very hard. Hunter to lot pick this. All right. 
medics. Let me get some medics. Thank you very much. Um, is there anything else that used to? The medical terminal very hard as well. The hundred to lock it that as well. I mean, hatch, rather. Well then, this is right. Artemis. Thanks for the information. All right, let's have a look here. Doctor M P. Again. About the disc. Right. Me. This one is not. It's also there's still this uh, this uh, power fist. Is it strong or I don't know. What about this, Cell personnel terminal. I already read this, so just put it any further. Toolbars. Module. Here. Did I close that door? There's anything. Oh, you can't sleep on that bed. Um. Why a Maxon's terminal? Very easy. Alright. So this is the room of Squire Maxon. So this is it. It. Uh. East. Zero out of five. Alright. Uh, ride, three out of five, flies, run it again, it's very easy I said, right, oh. cards, one out of five, uh, chairs, still one out of five, barrel, oh, oh, accessed, <clears throat> Barrel, what's the password? Hi, Squire Madison. How's the best kid in the Citadel doing today? Diary entry one. A stupid scribe, uh, Rothschild in his stupid lab. All I wanted to do was talk to the robot and see if it'd be my friend. But what if it can't walk? Okay. Uh, two? Yesterday, Sara taught me how to kill a man by stabbing him in the knee. I think I'm in love. <laughs> Sara taught me how to kill a man by stabbing him in the knee. I think I'm in love. Okay. Sorry, the Guardians of uh, Illifron. Illifron. Okay. Whatever shall we do, Mr. Wallingsworth? Molly asked. Mother will be home shortly and I've yet to clean my room. Heavens my, heavens me. Don't fret, Molly Dolly. We'll enlist a little help, that's all. So Wallingsworth then waddled his little teddy bear body into the front of the room. Pulled out, in a voice both sweet and strong, to those lying dormant on the shelves, toy box under the bed. Come now, you lot. Molly Dolly needs our help. And as we are her guardians, that means we'll all get fretting. Come on now, pick off those dust bunnies and off too. There rose a rustle and rumble from all corners of the room as rotting horse and railway car, book and baby doll, toy and game alike, all blossomed into impossible life. Mr. Wallensworth, but I I never knew, I thought I was just you. Oh, this is just wonderful, Molly exclaimed. Wonderful? Ah I was having a nice nap and a nice dream, and now you've gone and woken me up? And for what? Annual labor? That wasn't in the job description. Wallensworth, a small, pretty voice of dissent, belonged to one mousy Maguire, only his favorite stuffed animal, and one of the few companions granted the right to sleep on her bed. 
Oh, Melzy, you're alive. Molly ran to her bed and embraced the non blushy, plushy, pushing his body in a nearly stuffing, bursting bear hug. All right, enough, enough. You're crushing me. Molly released her hold and dropped Mousy back on the bed, looking at once excited and immensely disappointed that her favorite stuffed boy has just come to life and seemed to be a complete Briton. Now you listen here, Maguire, Bonesworth said. Being guardians of dear Miss Molly Dolly means we protect her in any way we can, even if that means unplugging the potty or taking out the trash. Oh yes, hiding up her room, and when the crawly creeps come, oh, and they will come, you get to do what was in your job. Not my way. Okay, a poem. Poem, Song of the Light Man. Tweedle dumpling, tweedle there, where's the younglings here? For theirs is youth and joy and power, five made one in the light man's tower. And when they come, these five of sun, the light man's progeny have won. So sound the trumpets clear and loud, and think beyond the stone shroud. That's crazy. Um. Uh, okay. Little D, little D. Little dumpling, air trust, air. But there is a youth enjoying power. Five made one the light man's power. When they come, these five of sun, the light man's progeny have won. They'll sound the trumpets clear and loud and think beyond the crowd. Guns and bullets. Vargas doesn't know I've been reading his copy of Guns and Bullets. I should probably keep it that way. I mean, it's right there, and there's a bunch of the den. What did you expect? Guns and boots? There is a bunch in the den. What did you expect? Okay. So there's a butch. I need, I need to find that butch. Okay. The den is over there, right? Okay. Uh, the den, the den, the den. The den is that way. There's a bunch. Guns increased by one. Well, uh, fortunately, I knew about this, so I, I now know about this. So, plus one to small guns means that uh, when it comes to my stats and skills, I go to 27 and 36. Uh, so, good. Oh. So, bones precision. Deception plus two and endurance plus two. Okay. Color. Hail. I have to look everywhere. Might be part of the museum here. Dresser. Okay. To whom is that? Is that the the that uh, the bedroom I mean the room of Elder Lions? B or what? Yeah, yeah. This is definitely the one from Elder Lions. Get that. Personal lodge. Okay. Wardrobe. Well safe. Very hard. Not 
quadrant watch it at the lion's terminal so at 100 go to ditch it Um, up here. Let's go into here. Um, personal lodge. Uh, and more like that, I suppose. Oh, there was a uh, some sort of a reunion and out of here. Us, gallows. You honor us with Frost. hail to you, by the traction of hospitality and on the word of elder lions. I welcome you to the citadel. I am Star Paladin Cross, keeper of the arm, and seneschal to elder lions. And I am honored to say I was acquainted with your father. Now, what may I do to help? Really? You? Wait, you knew my father? I did, and you as well. Long ago, I helped guard the water purifier against the super mutant horde. When your father left, I escorted the two of you to Megaton. He was a nobleman. I was saddened to hear of his passing. Yeah. But from what I've heard, he died with honor. He died for you. I only pray that my own death yep. has such meaning. <laughs> what does it matter how a man dies? Death is death. Died as he lived. Selfish? Wow. Um, loved him so much, I'll never forget him. And so our deeds are carried on through our sons and our daughters. Continue to remember him fondly. Continue to tell his story. And continue to do his work. Through you, he shall carry on. Oh. But now, I must ask you a difficult question. If I have your leave to do so. By all means, ask. I escorted your father across the wastes. It was the best I could contribute to his efforts to restore fresh water to the people. I would like the honor of escorting you in your journey to complete his work. What about the enclave? As a star paladin, I answer only to Elder Lions. He has given me leave to pursue the restoration of Project Purity. As I see fit. By aiding you in your travels, I shall fulfill that mission as best I am capable. Well, uh, I would be honored, Star Paladin Cross. Then I shall follow your leave and submit to your command. As James's child, I know I don't need to explain, but I am not your servant. If I do not like the path your actions take, I will return here. Now, let us go forward. Crush the Enclave. And fulfill your father's mission. All right. All right. Oh, okay. You're going to follow me, right? Not here. Yes, you will. Okay. So, <laughs> um, we've um, I suppose required the cross, Alp Elden Cross, uh, Alpus. Vigilance is necessary in this location. Be on your guard, my friend. Uh. Be here. I shall reflect on the battles past and the battles to come until your return. All right. Uh, yeah, wait. Hey, uh, Lions. What aid can I offer you, outsider? No, 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 outsider. You've seen them, so you know what we know. What more is there to say? If we can figure out where they're coming from, we might be able to stop them. If not... Oh. Well, stay strong. We have a companion now? Oh, Paladin Cross? Oh, that's crazy. Uh... Wait. For my notes? Three men, two men. Okay. Uh. 
Um, from Scribe Elizabeth Jameson, Elder Lyons. Elder, I have read the recent reports on the number of paladins and knights that have not reported in uh, when detected. I understand the chaotic nature of the situation in the field, but tradition demands that each brother who falls in battle have their death recorded in the scrolls. Not put forward our best effort to retrieve a proof of who has fallen and who might lived is unthinkable. I understand that every brother uh, needed for the efforts here at the Citadel in the city nearby. To that end, I intend to contract with outsiders and recover proof of which of our brethren have fallen to the enemy. I will ask that they recover dark tags from any fallen brother that, that they find. It is the least we can do without the resources for a full and honorable funeral for them. You, you needn't worry about providing rewards to these uh, rewards for you. Practice. I will pay them from my personal funds. Well worth it to me. Be able to both keep the tradition and not press the resources for your mission. Rose and Steel, Tribe Elizabeth Jameson, Head Librarian, Order of the Quill Hunter. Okay. Now, on to Elder Owen Lyons, Personal Part 1. That is without question truth. So, my quests. I have to ask Scribe uh, Rothschild for information about Vault 87. Okay. More than anyone else, I dare say. Certainly enough to know they're the greatest threat the Capital Wasteland has ever faced. The Brotherhood of Steel has encountered the Enclave before, you see. Over 30 years ago, back in California. Then they were led by a President Richardson. Now we've Richardson. got this Eden to contend with. It matters not now, as before they seek to control and destroy. All in the guise of restoring order. Your father, I fear, was just the beginning. Um, I'd like to know more about the Brotherhood of Steel. The Brotherhood is an old organization going back to the years just after the war. We are but a part of it. What would you like to know? Okay. Uh, if you're, as you said, just a part of the Brotherhood, where's the rest of it? The Brotherhood began on the West Coast. It exists there still. We were dispatched to this location many years ago. In truth, the Brotherhood of Steel has been struggling for years, both here and back home. Honor, truth, courage. These virtues seem to have little meaning in these troubled times, I'm afraid. Why are you here in the capital wasteland? Ah, no. That's the real question, isn't it? Our orders were, and are, to acquire any and all advanced technology and we have to the best of our abilities but when i realized the extent of the super mutant threat i felt it was my responsibility to aid the people in their struggle against them unfortunately my superiors back west disagree with my assessment of the situation they feel i've grown too attached to the local populace and they're right in any event, oh. the Enclave's arrival changes everything. How long have you been here? It's been over 20 years since we arrived, and we've been struggling to contain and eradicate the super mutants for nearly as long. With the arrival of the Enclave, I have a terrible feeling the super mutants are the least of our worries. Yeah, well... I don't know about that because um, maybe there are some more, you know, creatures, enemies that I would rather not encounter. The death claws, for example. Well, I wanted to know. So be it. Uh. Wait. What more did you want to know? There are some more. Oh, not. So okay. be it. Um. Anything you can tell me about the super mutants? Would you believe no? 
It's pathetic, really, considering we've been fighting those abominations for nearly 20 years. In all that time, all we've managed to do is to contain the threat, hold them back so they don't overrun every blasted settlement out here. But we don't really know anything. Where they're from, why they've infested the DC ruins. And now here we are, holed up in our citadel. Low on resources, low on troops. It's enough to make an old man so very tired. Yeah, I can understand that. Um, I'd like permission to trade. This is not normally something that we do. Trade with outsiders has proven to be problematic in the past. However, considering the circumstances, so be it. I'll send word to Durga that you have full access to trade. Uh, would you grant me permission to receive power armor training? Hmm, considering the circumstances, I think it would be prudent if you received such training, yes. Speak to Gunny in the Bailey. He will train you in the proper use of power armor. Fear not, I will send word that I have given my approval. You'll find him in the Bailey, I will send word that I have given my approval. Okay. Well, uh, I have to go now. Of course. All right, so I have permission to trade. Um, Durga. Who is Durga? Where is Durga? Well, this is, uh... Impressive. I have a lot of stuff to work on now, but more importantly, I now have authorization to use and to be trained wear power armor. So that's hey. impressive. I like how they I like how they uh, sleep with their power armor on. The uh, it's complicated, but case. In any case. Alright. Uh, it is well to see you again. Shall we continue? Um. Not just yet. I wanted to talk to you about something. What do you wish to speak to me about? Let's talk about your tactics. I am open to your suggestions. talk to her so that she can change her combat style and about how close she's following me okay it is always a subject worthy of discussion uh, straight equipment in the words of elder Theus a brother well equipped is a brother keeping to his duty Wait, 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 wait. So, so, if I want to wear power armor, all right, and just give all I don't need to Ross, how much she could, how much can she, uh, keep? Easy. Okay. Uh, let's go. Lead the way. All right. Um. Wow. Um. New. Are you stuck? 